Keith, when you make the song, you put it on social media, how did you end up collaborating with this accomplished producer here? How did this happen? Them joints? What happened? Who wants to tell the story? All right, now check this out. This okay. is what happened. Okay. So he put the video out, right? Uh -huh. uh, I'm watching TV. We're Netflix and the sun, me and my girl, you know what I mean? And she has on her phone uh, Kedron's post. And so I'm listening to him sing, and I'm, you know, I'm muting the TV now because he sounds amazing already. You know what I mean? But mm -hmm. the parts that you guys were talking about earlier when he says, uh, uh, we've been hunted as prey. My people don't want no struggle. Uh, my, my people don't want any trouble. We've been, we, we had enough struggle. That part there, when he did that run, you know, when certain things happen, when you listen to songs or moments in songs, when it really hits you like in the gut, you know what I mean? And that's what happened. And I was just like, whoa, wait a minute, whoa. And it's, it, it moved me so much. I was like, yo, I have to do something with this. This is, this is crazy. And it's, I don't know, it's just, I just opened up the computer, you know what I mean? And just created a, a track around it. And uh, I, I, I posted it and, 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 and went to bed, you know what I mean? And I woke up and it, it there it go. So y'all didn't know each other before this? No, I actually contacted them after and was just like, yo, your voice is amazing. And, 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 and what you've done was amazing. Of course, you know, it, 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 it encouraged me to do what I did. You know what I mean? I just want to say thank you. You know what I mean? And oh, so he had the raw song online and then you it was just the and added to it. And then y'all, oh, okay. Right, right. And and so, so hmm. what I wanted to do was actually talk to them, just get to know him and Janetta and um, figure out, you know, whether or not it was even worth us making this a full song. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, uh, of course, uh, while we were thinking about that and courting each other and getting to know each other, uh, you can imagine the, the, the calls he was getting or the calls I was getting. It was just, you know, or so organically, it was just like, you know what? I think we know we need to do. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> Kijan, were you surprised, like, you know, how fast it went viral and that it went viral? Um, yes, ma'am. I was, like, really surprised because right before I recorded it, I never had, like, in my mind that, okay, this is going to go viral. Like, this is just going to just reach everybody. But when it went viral, I knew, okay, this is, this is something. And people were just commenting, like, this has to be a full song. Make this a full song. And I was just, like... Yes. And yeah, they were saying in the comments, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. So it was just a lot of like just just pushing me more and more um to keep going. So yeah. What kind of feedback are you getting from people about the song? I I mean, besides they wanted <laughs> to get the whole song. I mean, what what's what are they saying? What's what's the what's the street saying? The, the streets are saying that he's a star. <laughs> Max. We already knew that from jump when we saw the video, you know what I mean? But the streets the, the streets want more actually. The streets uh, it, 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 it's, it's, it's a, it's a bed of unrest. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Jen, uh, being 13 years old, what was it like to know that a Grammy winning producer was interested in working with you? Because there's a lot of producers out here. Oh, let me get to the <laughs> studio, blah, blah, blah. And it, it, it leads to nothing. But this is mm. someone that's legit, knows what he's doing, Grammy winning. You know Ooh. what I mean? So, I mean, that had to be like, I don't know, a mind blowing type of thing. <laughs> like, um, for real, for real. Yes, because when he first did the um uh, the uh, the track around, I just want to live with just the regular acapella version, um the original video, and it was like I first saw when he did it, I was like I was just jamming, I was just grooving, I was like <laughs> yeah, and um it was it was really really um fire what he did. And that, I, yeah, I liked it. So it was um, really good just to have um, somebody just really supporting me and recognize me um, in my gifts. So now we're here today. I felt like I had no choice, man. His his message is urgent, you know what I mean? And it, it needed to be heard. So it's just like, man, what? Oh, I just wanted to add on and, and be a part of it because, you know, what he what he's what he was saying needed to be heard for sure. And the smile, I just got to say, like, you definitely light up the screen. You really do. Like, you definitely have that star quality. I'm just telling you right, right now. You, right, you right. really do. Thank you. It's important. Like, there's a lot of people like to sing that don't need to be out there. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey. right. So you were all <laughs> in the studio with, with Dr. Dre, right? So how was that? That's another legend. Like, how are you yeah. accomplish? 
Okay, them them joints. He thirteen. Right. He accomplishing. He bucket list. Dre right. Grammy winning producers. I'm viral. Like we got to fight together at thirteen. I, we got to. Well, not you. I got to step my game up. How was that? <laughs> he with Dre. Man, it's a blessing. Shout out to Dre too, man, because he he definitely helped out uh, with that. Man, I asked him to post it, and then he posted it, and then LeBron posted it afterwards, man. So he always had my back, man. Aftermath is family, man. So yeah. shout out to Dre. But uh, man, it's you know, hard work pays off. What can I say? <laughs> yeah, both seem to have good vibes, good energy. Like that's oh, what I pay attention to. Like that, that, people like that. I think it's time for the good people to stop finishing first again. I think we went you know through a dark, saying? like seriously, I think we went through a dark era where it's like, as you see like all this raggedy stuff getting rewar- awarded and now and rewarded. And now I'm, I'm seeing like this purity and this like goodness that's getting like shy now. And I think that's, I, I love it. So so Man. why was it so important? No, my pleasure. Why, why was it so important for you guys to release a song on Juneteenth? I, you know, I just want to live on Juneteenth. Well, we all know the history behind Juneteenth, and we just felt like, you know, uh, um, uh, a memorable day. We'll always remember when we put this song out, um, uh, and, and, it, and it means something to us. Uh, what we want to do, um, because, of course, you know, it ain't going to stop. We got so many different things that we're working on, and um, we're conscious as to when we're actually releasing these things. We want to keep doing things like that. And, you know, it's just like we... It's, there's more meaning to uh, to to what we're doing, uh, to everything when we drop in the song. You know what I mean? Uh, the context of it, and you know everything that goes along with it. And America's hurting right now, so it, it's it, we we I can see why we're latching on to this. You know what I mean? It right. feels to right. you hear your, your voice, and I mean it's not just us. It's um, Barack Obama, Oprah Winfrey, Jackson, LeBron James, all sharing your video. How does that feel? Like that's it feels like I'm just like for, for all the people that shared it, um, just to think like Barack Obama just just like he's like the former president of the United States. It's just like really I'm I'm just really grateful and thankful for all the people that um share my video and it's just this this journey of me just starting my music career um in the industry it's just really been amazing ride just to um keep on pushing myself and growing in my gift so it's just, it's really been a good journey i'll say because weeks after the song went viral you landed your own record deal with warner records what? Yeah. All right. <laughs> I mean, so you third yeah once again you right. making us feel like we all get our lives together not you <laughs> my friend so Record, so what, what What was your reaction? Record deal, this, you, you put the song out, gets picked up by this, you know, Grammy winning producer. Then you're in, you know, you're meeting Dre, you're meeting those people, Barack Obama's retweeting your video, Oprah Winfrey, like all the who's, everyone is like feeling you. Then you get a record deal. Are you just like on cloud nine at all times right now? <laughs> it's like when Warner reached out um, to me, it it was like, just like, wow like this is and I had to just fix myself because I was like okay, <laughs> this is the start of my career and I asked God for it and he gave it to me so I was like okay let me get into my my singing and my business uh, mode and let me right. focus on what is going to be happening in the future so I had to um, really just get in the right mood and so I can deliver messages um, in music, so landing the record deal with Warner, that was one of the most best days of my life. When I signed the paper, that was like one of the most just happiest, exciting, crazy days of my life. So um, I'm just really happy. And Dem Joints, you gotta feel really good about this because you know because of you know you doing what you did, like it's kind of set this thing. Well, you, you set each other in motion, but you took it to the next level, so it got that you know, that attention. So that's got to feel right. good for you to, to see something that your eye spotted, your ear spotted, and see it blow up like this. And it seems like y'all got to break oh, yeah, it. Uh, you know, I feel like it had to. I mean, everything that happens happens for a reason, and it has to happen that way. Like I said, his his message is ur- urgent. His message is urgent. The messages that we're going to continue to spread is urgent. So it's like, 
you know, I'm, I'm, I'm excited about what's to come. I'm excited about, uh, you know, praying and excited for more blessings to come with this, this young man. And man, I'm ready to go. <laughs> Keijan, will you focus on uh, singing gospel music or secular music? Would just be gospel or just... It's um like I I I would say um I would say like I do mo- motivational inspirational like gospel I I I'm like that type around you gotta like mix that, it up yeah yeah that genre um but I wouldn't say like secular though but I would say like inspirational motivational kind of um just to keep you going or have faith. Um, you know, on the gospel side, I will always um, sing gospel music and it will, nice. it will. that's the foundation. Got to add that for sure. I can't wait to see where your career goes. I really, I really can't wait. Speaking of big time careers, them joints. Now you work with Brandy, Rihanna, Janet Jackson. I mean, basically the who's who in music. What advice do you have for up and coming artists? Because you definitely know what you're doing. Right. There's no such thing as quitting. Uh, the consistency is the key. Work hard at it. Just keep chipping at the stone and don't look up at the statue. Okay. That's real. We can use right. that. And lastly, Keijan, what do you want people to take away from your song? I want people to take away from my songs. Well, even my I Just Want to Live song and even more upcoming songs. But I want people to just take away just a lot of hope a lot of courage, um, a mood of happiness, and um, just to, like, if they're even feeling sad, uh, I can be able to just to give some um, happiness or cheer them up in their life, or even they may, they, they may be feeling just kind of um, depressed or, you know, just um, a lot of things that's, that is going on even with COVID, just to give some hope in the world um that we can you want to make people feel feel good right so so with that yes. being said i think what would make all of our viewers feel good is if you go ahead and sing a little something for us real quick before we wrap just go ahead come on we got to hear something live from you <laughs> okay um i'm a young black man doing all that i can to stay Oh, when I look around and I see what's being done to my kind every day, I'm being hunted as prey. My people don't want no trouble. We ain't found no struggle. I just want to leave. God, protect me. I just want to leave. I just want to leave. Yes, I want to thank Keith and Brian. Y'all better follow this young man. This is a star in them joints. Thank you so much for doing what you did and stepping up and making this happen. Much respect to you, you, my brother. Like, I really, I mean that.